Wait, I don't believe it. She's moving. I'm not sure I've ever seen a contestant with more pure grit than this. Well, she's hurt bad. How much longer can Scarlet last? Nothing. Gonna stop me. Not sure she wants to hang around those explosive barrels for too long. Those barrels could finish her off. She has got to keep moving. She is on pure adrenaline at this point. But it takes more than that to survive on Homicidal All-Stars. That trap won't hurt anyone now. Healing station. Scarlet's luck may have finally turned around. Gotta get to that station. Not so fast, bitch. And it's an ambush right in front of the healing station. Poor Dios. The defenders couldn't have caught Scarlet in a more vulnerable position. But she takes cover and prepares for another fight. She's not finished yet. And she hits her target. The scum finds some cover of his own. Staying in cover pays off for Scarlet. Scarlet shakes the cobwebs and shows off her speed. Oh, and down goes the scum. Setting up an overwatch. And it's another hit! Scarlet is dodging bullets left and right. Just incredible! Scarlet deals with the ambushers despite her weakened state. She can finally make her way to the healing station. <sighs> Much better. That had to feel good, but will it be enough to get her through the rest of tonight's episode? Fire, Scarlet. And she's past the fire trap. And Marty Manson's back on the field. Scarlet could learn a thing or two from this veteran contestant if she's able to stay alive long enough. Red? Where the fuck were you? I turned around and you were gone. 
What did I tell you about sticking close? Lesson learned. Believe me. Should fucking hope so. Jesus, you look like shit. You okay to fight? Always. All right. Combat arena's next, tough gal. You take point this time, so I can't lose you again. Can I have an autograph? Go ahead, sign it. Gotta start building your brand. Hi, uh, can I have an autograph? Sure. What would you like me to write? Oh, uh, just whatever your name is. Way to keep those fans on your side, Red. It can help. This is it, Red. You good to go? Yeah, I think so. Shit, you better know so. Now let's do this. Looks like the challengers are gearing up for tonight's main event. As always on the show, the deadly defenders they'll be facing were selected from the most violent inmates across the country. Are Scarlet and Marty up to the challenge? Time for the final battle of the night. Will the challengers survive what's in store for them? One thing's for sure, it's gonna be bloody. Absolutely brutal! Sets himself into an Overwatch position. Hoping the enemy breaks cover. Unable to dodge that incoming fire. in close quarters with that razor-sharp sword. He loads a fresh clip. Unsheathed his sword. Looks like the arena's about to get a bit more crowded. Watch for now. That's one deep gash! The challengers can use those mobile healing stations, courtesy of Omega Corporation, to patch themselves up during combat. Good 
goodness! Absolutely devastating! That blade looks razor sharp! Defenders ready to take down the contestants. and reloads. Missed by inches. Wasted ammo. Ooh, a devastating hit. And we're unexpectedly joined by the show director, Orion Ford himself. Greetings, challengers. You're doing well. Maybe too well. Let's see how you handle some complications. That's more like it. Now you've got a better chance of going out with a bang. Contestants. Total misfire. Oh, a lethal looking hit. Shell out of the blue. Oh, she takes him down. And that wraps another challenge. The contestants sail through without losing anyone along the way. Folks, what an explosive start to the season! Tune in tomorrow night to see how these determined challengers deal with the dangers of the old quarter, including a new defender they've never faced before. You won't want to miss it! Make it back here alive. I almost did me too.
this? Your weapons, please. Spoil the surprise. Right. That guy is Contestants, this is your showrunner, Orion Ford. Welcome to your home away from home. Eh, I've heard this shit before. I'll be in my bunk. This is a safe space for you to rest and recuperate between episodes. So kick back a bit and enjoy the quiet. Record a contestant confessional, or maybe check some out from previous seasons. Listen to pre-screened audio recordings, or maybe just talk shop with your fellow challengers. Once you're ready for the next episode, head to your quarters and enter your rejuvenation chamber. It'll help you get in shape to give our loyal audience the show they deserve. And if you manage to survive until the end of the season, I'll look forward to seeing you in person at the award ceremony. I'll be there. You popped your cherry, kid. Survived your first episode. Just barely. Yeah, well, maybe next time you'll stick closer to old Marty. You don't want to go it alone out there. Besides, why wouldn't you want to hang with a former champ? Yeah, about that. You really think you can win this a second time? Not if I have to keep saving your sorry ass from trouble all the time. Now get into your rejuvenation chamber. You need to get patched up for tomorrow night's episode. That's my personal audio log. Just me reminding myself of tactics for the upcoming episodes. Sounds useful. You could check it out if you want. Ain't got nothing to hide. Thanks. You almost got me in the old district back in my original run. Urban arenas always have a shit ton of traps. Trip wires, hanging bombs, spike traps, you name it. And those goddamn fumes can't shoot the fuckers while they're surrounded by their smoke screens. Best strategy is to get close and punch the smoke out of them. Think I'll listen to the rest later, if you don't mind. Yeah, knock yourself out. Challenger, this is your personal audio recording device, courtesy of the Omega Corporation. You can use it as your personal audio log, record messages for your fans, or send audio letters to your friends and family back home. If you want your recording to be sent to your loved ones, if and when you're eliminated, 
Reach out to the production crew to discuss the shipment details. Think I'll pass. All right, episode two. Let's see what you've got. Welcome back to Homicidal All-Stars, where volunteer challengers seeking huge cash prizes face hardened convicts and deadly traps in 100% real life or death action. Tonight's episode opens as we follow an unlikely duo, former champion Maury Manson and bounty hunter Scarlett Martillo as they prepare to face the extreme dangers of the old quarter. Remember, Red, we stick together. I remember. Defuse the trap. That's more blood than is in a single person. Yeah. Two, maybe three victims here. Victims? That's cop talk. Thought you were a bounty hunter. Guess I spent too much time hanging around them. Huh. Dios. Shit. Well, better him than us, I suppose. Trap disabled. Nobody's gonna have time to stop for a snack during this challenge. Hey, over here! Hey, Damn, I thought you were Calamity here. Jane. Come on, you look please. a bit like her. Sorry to disappoint. It's not your fault. You can sign it anyway. Oh, now I have to find the real Calamity Jane. Disable that trap. And that's how you deal with traps. Keeping an eye out for reward boxes pays off again. with no warning. Are they up to the challenge? Playing defensively for now. Explosion! Can't hit the moving target! Miss that one! Waiting is time. And he takes a hit after breaking cover. That's 
scum is not getting up. And they both come out of it alive. The crowd always appreciates a chance to get up close and personal with the contestants. An autograph, please? Nice to meet you. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry. I forgot your name. It's Scarlet. Oh, I would like the hair. <laughs> I'll remember now. That's it. You rock. Could that be the access card that opens Damn the it. Mega Mall? You're on your own. And this just became more interesting. located a safe spot behind the wall of flame. And the challengers make their way through a scorching situation. Holy shit. Get used to it. Our sponsors must be feeling generous. The challengers can now enter the Mega Mall. Taking care of that trap. She's got the reward box. Get ready for some blood, folks. And I'm not talking about the selections at the deli counter. Now we'll find out if Don't Die is on our Challenger shopping list. to come to him. He totally misses the targets. And he takes some incoming fire while in motion. <gasps> Waiting for a better shot. Goes wide. Staggered.
She narrowly avoids getting hit. with that grenade. He takes care of that depleted clip. Like fish in a barrel. Fetching some lead. Laying in wait. Thanking his lucky stars on that one. himself up. Great shots. That's going to slow them down. Takes care of some housekeeping. Loaded back up. Missed that one by inches. He probably wishes he had that one back. He tops off his weapon. He missed. 
This is his target! up an ambush. Clean miss on the... Making it look easy. He's got to be disappointed with that. How are they still on their feet? Sniper like precision. One less scum to deal with. Drew some blood. Ready to dish out more pain. Taking up a defensive position. A bot shot. Shot goes wide. He wasn't even close on that one. Not what we call a hit. Reloaded and refreshed. Bad aim on that one. Quite a pounding. Reloading. Refusing to be rushed. No dice on that shot.
almost daring his opponents to come his way. 